people killed in 24 hours in Park Heights. That prompted a community organization, the Tandia family, to hold a critical conversation about ways to end the violence. WMAR 2 News' Nordea Lewis attended that meeting. She fills us in on the details. While organizers stress the importance for people to not leave the city, but to better their engagement in the city to promote change. Each one of us has a part to play in the solution. 25-year-old Tavaz Miles, 20-year-old Amar Burris, 24-year-old Jalil George, and a 32-year-old were all shot and killed in Park Heights. Their loved ones are all mourning their young lives and searching for answers as police haven't made any arrests yet. But community organizations like the Tendaya family believes there is power in numbers, which is why they're begging neighbors to not abandon their community so we can all fight for change. It's 600,000 approximately people in Baltimore City. Everybody can't leave. Somebody has to shift and change the community and make it better or else generations of us will continue to go down the same path that we see happening. We're not okay with it. This meeting was all about finding solutions. Organizers say they want to hold neighbors accountable and protect the next generation, which is why they laid out a roadmap to success. When you're thinking about solutions, you're thinking about, I need to talk to the superintendent. I need to talk to the mayor. But really, it's your personal decisions day to day. We're here to say, get organized, join a local organization, get involved with your community so that you can bring some tangible change, some tangible resources to people that need it. We're not talking about a fight for a day or a fight for a week or a fight for a year, but we're talking about a consistent effort, a consistent fight for years to come. And unless we do something to shift the conditions of the community, people will continue to die. And if anyone has information on the shootings, you're encouraged to contact Metro Crime Stoppers at 1-8667-LOCKUP. In Baltimore, for WMAR 2 News, I'm Norday Lewis.